Hey guys, RC here. Welcome back, Football Manager 19, Episode 5. We are in Bolivia uh, with our second club. So let's take a quick look. A couple of things to catch up on. We've reached the trade deadline. We've had a good run of form. Uh, so we won 3-1 and had a 2-2 draw last episode. Uh, we played San Jose. We beat them again 1-0. Luis Serrano scored in the 44th minute. Always ready. We got a 3-2 win. Pacheco scored. Sharamoni scored. Elizice scored. Uh, they got one back in the 77th minute to make it close, but we held on for the win. Oriente, uh, Petroleum Orient, I guess, is what that translates to. 0-0 zero, zero draw. They had a player sent off in the 31st minute. We had an injury to Maldonado. Uh, could not uh, manage anything there. Pretty large crowd, too. Look at that. Oof. Uh, then we beat Sport Boys. 2-0, uh, Sharamoni with a brace, uh, including a 94th minute uh, dr uh, shot that he drilled into the goal. Uh, Real Potosi, a 1-0 win. Uh, Elizice scored again. And Aurora, a 2-2 draw. This was, uh, yeah, this was a brutal game. Uh, Bejarano scored a brace. Uh, the penalty, that was okay. The Lescano goal, <laughs> we had the ball near midfield. Our right winger had the ball, played it back to the keeper. The keeper played a heavy touch on the ball. Their striker, who was on in an onsides position, I guess, charged and then got to the ball inside the box. It was inside. Uh, no, it was it was just outside the box. So the keeper had come up near, uh, you know, between the six yard line and the and the spot, put a heavy touch on it, came out, and just had no shot at stopping the the ball. But the, their striker was the only player in in a country mile. <laughs> just it was uh, that was brutal. So. Uh, we were down 2-0 at that point. Barano got uh, the brace to equalize. So we'll call that lucky and uh, take the point. We're currently sitting fourth, 17 matches in. We've got three matches in hand, and we are only seven points back. So possible to go top of the table. But we're in, we're in cup qualifying. For the Bolivian Cup or the Copa, uh, what's the uh, what's the cup that we're playing for? Uh, da, 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 Copa Libertadores. I think that's the uh, okay. That's the South American Cup because that's every league. So cool. So we might be playing continental uh, some continental football. Uh, anyway, let's get to uh, transfers. Uh, we did have, uh, we've made another offer. I don't know if I'm going to be able to even make the deal, but this will be for end of contract in July, to come in July 1st. Um, so let's take a look at the transfer history. Um, I thought we sold somebody else. Could have swore I sold somebody else. No, guess not. Never mind. Just disregard that. Oh, wait, that's in, out, no. All right, well, anyway. <laughs> uh, let's see, match preview. So we are on the road. You guys have yet to see the blue away kits. I got I, I get to I've gotten to see those just a couple of times, but we're typically in our home uniforms. I really want to see those away uniforms. Is there a way to uh, is there a way in your your club settings to change the kits that you wear? So there's the away kits, just so you could see them. I wish you you know I guess they don't have I guess they don't have their their alternative kits in the game. The alternative kits are 
pretty nice looking. I like them. I'll try to see if I can pull up a picture of them and show them to you later on, if I remember. Uh, anyway, let's get back to here. All right, we've won two, lost nine, but we are favored today, not by a lot. We're going to just stay with our tactic, man, because it's working. All right, Oviedo's in, LZ Shade, Quellar. Yep, I am feeling that. I'm feeling it, man. All right, uh, encourage, morale boost. Uh, morale's really good, except for uh, Juarez. And uh, you'll notice Barano, Bejarano's up top, uh, our, our other striker, the, the big score. Uh, he got hurt again. And then we played Adrian at center back, and he was supposed to come back to full training the next day. He got hurt. And he's out for like three more weeks. So, yeah. Oh, nice tackle. Went right through him. All right. Flicked on. We get hold of it. Oh, that was a good try. I liked where his head was at, what he was thinking. Uh-oh. Oh, oh Donacetti. If you got one name, you get, you're supposed to be pretty good, you know, so fourth goal of the season. That was not good. Demand more. All right, we got two guys on the outside. All right, Queller knocks it away for a corner. We've been pretty solid defensively, so pretty happy with that. Oh, good clearance. Good job. We've been a lot of braces. I, I think I've got more goals already here in the opening stage than we had in four seasons in Minnesota. What? What? Oh, come on. Get there, get there. All right, controlled by Oviedo. Elizice. Oh, it went across. Yes. Now the Nato. He went up in the air like a Toyota commercial and then scissor kicked it in. That was great. That was brilliant. All right, we're back on square footing. All right, that went wide of the mark. 17 minutes in. Uh, Pacheco picked up a uh, bruised ankle. We're going to let him keep playing. All right, Bejarano. Juarez. Across to Sandoval. Takes a touch, and that's a poor finish. All right, I need. That's what I need right there. I just didn't have it open far enough. I wanted to be able to see their percentage. All right, so yeah, you know, Pacheco is at 64. Let's sub him off. Um, Let's bring Elizice back, and then we'll bring Serrano on. There we go. Uh, just a heads up, uh, I don't think it'll affect things too much, but uh, I am on the verge of becoming a grandfather for the first time. So when that day gets here, of course, I'll be at the hospital with my daughter and... Uh, you know, we'll be welcoming uh, the newest member to our family into the world. And, uh, you know, that may take me away from recording and uploading. But usually I'm a few days ahead. So um, I am trying to start going, like I mentioned last episode, trying to get this uh, to more of a daily upload. Five, at you know, at least five days a week, maybe six. 
Uh, the five, I don't think will be an issue. The weekend, it'll just depend on how far ahead I can get. Uh, encourage the players. And then, uh, you know, how, how much I'm getting uploaded. So, like today, you know, in between recording, I'm doing a marathon. Today, I've been up since about 5.30. And, uh, oh, that's ugly. Is he gone? Is he gone? Yellow card. All right. Um, anyway, don't expect that to affect you guys too much. But just a heads up that if if I go off the air for a couple of days, that's what's going on. And then, uh, you know, then, of course, I'll be looking forward to playing the granddad role uh, at the house uh, as we move forward. Uh, but that's uh, hopefully, you know, should be a couple of weeks off. But at this point, you know, you never know. So wanted to at least give you fair warning. Uh, good job getting back on defense, Flores, our left back, the youngster. All right, good header. Oh, taken down. Oh, that was dirty. Dirty. No card? Come on. Over Beto. Gets it back. Dropped in. Excellent. Well, yeah, let's just play it, play it all the way back to the keeper now, why don't we, huh? Oh, out to Flores in some space. Oh, headed right into the keeper's arms. Mm. You saw it down there? Yeah, Club Deportivo de University of San Francisco. But then up here at Sucre, I don't know what Sucre stands for. San Francisco, I guess. <laughs> it's, it's, it's weird because it's the University of uh, St. Francis Xavier, or Xavier, but then it's the University of Sucre, University of San Francisco. Uh, who do we take off? Who do we take off? David Cheka. Yeah, let's go ahead and pull Chip, put Cheka on for Flores. He's he's playing well, but he's he's tired. And that's two subs. I could have done my third one right there and been happy, but oh, nice little flick on header. Uh, he lets Segredo pick up the ball. He's got runners through. Oh, it goes in on a deflection. Bejarano, nice. Fourth goal of the season. We need him to pick up the scoring with our primary striker down. Two to one. Good job, boys. Uh, da, 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 da. Concentrate. All right, Juarez picks up a yellow. Oh, Queller with the nice save. Good job, youngster. Oh, nice first touch by Serrano. Oh, how did he not put that in? How did that not go in? Oh, he charged in out of nowhere. Got Hirano, heavy touch there. Back to Elizice. Juarez, Cheka, cross. Oh, Maldonado. <laughs> oh, that was a choke job. All right, I'm going to go ahead and call call for a sub here. Uh, Maldonado for Suspedes. Suspe I think I got that right. Sounded right. All right, Maldonado got a yellow. That short corner. Over you, over Beto. Nah, you can't do that, Serrano. Wonder if you can't shout from the 
at certain points of possession. Oh, Obavedo went looking for the far post. Ooh. All right, good clearance. Come back to that. Good job. Oh, nice pass into space. Sagrito makes a run into the box. Keeper makes himself big. Ah. All right. Uh, praise. Uh, that's got to be an offsides. All right, let's uh, let's do a little bit of time wasting. Eighteen to ten on shots, ten percent possession, four clear cut chances. I feel bad only having two goals because there were a couple in there that we should have put away. All right, Bejarano lays it back to Suspedes. Finds Cheka coming on the overlap. Oh, nice ball over the top. Bejarano! Serrano with a great assist. Bejarano puts it in for number five. That gives him a brace. How many braces have we had this season? That's insane. I'm so used to barely scoring at Minnesota <laughs> to, to our primary strikers adding a brace. All right, Obervedo. Meow. What's going on over there? Check a taken down in the box. Bejarano's lining up for the hat trick. Oh, God, I jinxed him. I jinxed him. He put it right into the bread basket. Five clear cut chances. How did we not score? Oh, man. You hate missing penalties. Obavedo knocked away. All right, probably the last possession. Nope, there's full time. A lot of bookages. Boy, up in Venezuela, we'd have half the team suspended to uh, next match. All right, excellent job. A little rough. <laughs> A little rough. All right, we'll be back for uh, Royal Pari here in a minute. Quality of possession, two to three days. So he should be back for the next match. All right, we'll be back in a minute. So that midfielder that we had put a bid in for, he accepted it. So he'll come in uh, end of contract, uh, which will be July 1st. So we'll pick up two new players for the closing leg. And then, of course, we'll, we should open transfers again. So we'll, we'll see how that looks. I don't think we're going to be able to afford a whole lot, but it's been nice that we've made some money this year. Um, actually, wow, that's gone up. How did that go up? I don't know. I think we're at 804, but didn't we only have like $19,000 last time we looked at this? Oh well. I don't need to spend all the money, <laughs> right? Uh we are actually losing a little money now. Uh, all right, match preview. So we're at home favorites, ooh, 78 and calm. It's a nice day at the stadium. Serrano, Elizice. Yeah, let's go ahead and bring Bruno Lucas on. Uh, let's give David Cheka a start back there. Probably. Adrian is injured. He'll be back in four days, so we're not going to mess with him. Pachico, Segredo. What are you doing back there? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. 
All right, well, let's get to it. All right, so we are a little weak in the midfield right now from what I can see. Can't have everything, I suppose. All the white. All right, he lumps it up top. Oh, just cleared over the top. Oh, I think Baharana was making a run on that. Pretty sure. I'm going the wrong way. I want to. Nope. I want to go over this way. Get centered, man. Take as big around as I am. I'd always be centered up, but oh well. <laughs> See, that's that's not good. See, now I need to turn that way. Now I'm losing focus. Shot blocked. See, I wasn't giving it my all, and he couldn't put it in the net. My fault. My fault, guys. Quit playing it. Quit playing it short. I'm pretty sure I have checked that, and it says mixed. I'm not seeing much in the way of a mix. Oh, Bejarano over the top. Oh, he couldn't poke through there. Tried to take a bad shot. Get creative. Inspired. It's like he's a poet. Stalking the sidelines. Come on, fellas. Juarez picks up his seventh yellow of the season. So Juarez is back from his uh, ankle injury last match, but he's not near full fitness. Lucas squared in. Oh, my God, that keeper dove out of nowhere. Like Stretch Armstrong or something. Or Mr. Fantastic, if you like that better. Be interested to see how much they rebound at halftime. So we're 68, 69. Only up to 72. So that's not great. All right, and then you watch your step. You watch your step. I'm just going to have to resign myself to the fact that they're going to be a little more tired. Oh, nice ball. Maldonado can't get there, though. Ah. Oh, Elaziche into the wall. That's too bad. Juarez finds Pancheco. Juarez out on the wing. Tackle the way. Push forward. He headed it right back to him. That was not good. Wide open, just outside the spot. About as easy as a penalty kick, too. God damn it. He headed it right back to him. Perfect setup. All right, we're going to go. I'm going to drop him back. Bring him on. And then. Yeah. 
Now that's a throw in. That's how you do it. Why can't you do that all the time? All right, we've got some space now. Serrano chips it over the top, finds the near post, can't sneak it in past the keeper. All right, Quellar comes and picks up the ball. Gonna hoof it out. Nope, oh, out to the center back. All right, he plays it up near midfield, out wide into space, overlap from Bruno Lucas. Oh, another nice ball comes to. Damn it. Um, Segredo. Not really, huh? All right, let's pull Lucas off. They're just sitting on the ball after that corner kick, man. Come on, fellas. Boy, he is just dead tired, boy. If I put him... You know what? Uh... I'm going to put him in for Juarez. Yep. Out of position, but it's an attacking role. He's a, he's a striker winger. Ten shots to three, two clear cut, two half, and we haven't found the net. We're on attacking. We don't have time wasting on. Now see right there is where you should try to put it in. Oh my God, it hit his own guy. Oh, that might have went in. Shit. That was crap. All right, let's finish the day. We'll take a look at the current. Oh, Fulham avoids relegation over in England. It's April. We're, uh, we have two months left in the season. And the opening stage of the season that lasts all freaking year. I guess I guess every league lasts all year, but you know it just seems <laughs> seems you know a little shorter. Uh, let's see, uh, oh, unlucky in defeat, I would say so. Twenty games into life, raging Cajun wasted little time. Signed five players for a total of six hundred twenty-five thousand, which was a screw up, uh, including Peter Sadie Flores. Hmm. Junior Lemos. Homegrown player update. All right, where are we at now? So we're still second. A point up, two games in hand. That's six. So, yeah, we can't catch Wilsterman now, even with matches. But still, you know, we're playing well, man. Ten wins, five draws, only four losses. Yeah, I'm pretty happy. Pretty, pretty, pretty happy. All right, so we've got a month left. Let's go ahead and come back for the last two matches of the opening stage, Potosi and Wisterman. 
or Wilsterman. And uh, we will see how we stand at that point. That was a home match. We had 6,000 fans. I like that. I like that a lot. It's helping make us profitable. Um, yeah, I think we just kind of need to move through the finish this opening stage and then you know then we have the playoffs in June July and then we start the next next phase um assuming we're assuming we're in the playoffs is there a playoff is there a playoff well we can go back to that's not what i want overall table Here we go. All right, that was actually. I don't know if well. Yeah, there's. I don't know if I don't know if there's a playoff or not. So I'm not sure how this works, or if you just start again at zero. And then combine them but anyway we'll come back uh yeah like i said last two games of the opening stage and then we'll figure out what's going on from there because first season it's all new so let's kind of get through a handful of games and uh move on so guys hit the like button subscribe if you don't mind thanks for checking out this series let me know what you think of our signings um yeah i botched it up by spending all our money on that one player by mistake but uh, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. See you guys next time. Bye.